Good afternoon, you tourists. It is a lovely Friday, July 25th, and this will be my first video that I do. It may be my last until I get my background all set up and pretty like I want. Uh, my first video from my HP Pavilion computer. Um, I just figured out how to lower the screen to a height that I can actually see things on because I'm 5'4 and I'm not very tall. So every day I'm like, looking up and I'm like, how is this going to record my face when I can't even get this to lower? So I finally just turned it around, looked at it, and I said, oh, just tilt it. Duh. Sometimes I wonder if I'm as smart as I should be <laughs> in life. I really do. But what I want to talk about today is Nicole Brown Murphy. Sleeping with Lilo Sean's husband, Antoine Foucault. Um, well, I can't confirm sleeping. She, there is footage of her kissing him. Video footage. Um, he is still married to Lilo Sean. I don't know if they're divorced. I mean, they're not divorced. I don't know if they're separated. They're going through some type of issue. Whatever the case may be. It was not Nicole's place to be kissing on that person's man. She issued a weak whack apology today, that yesterday, that said. She thought they were divorced. No, you didn't. And that she's a family friend. If you're a friend, how come you don't know that the status of their marriage? I know people don't always tell everybody everything, but if you're a friend, I call somebody a friend, Someone who knows the status of your marriage. If you're a friend, then how come you don't know if she's not divorced? But Nicole Community Vagina Murphy has supposedly a history. Lisa Ray said she slept with her husband. Or no, 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 tried to. Let me make sure I get, I'm not a gossip vlogger, so let me make sure I get all my information correct. She said she slept with her husband. Or saying it wrong again, tried to attempt to make she tried her shot at somebody's husband, basically. And Lisa Ray said it ruined her marriage. I'm like, hey. So there's the Lisa Ray thing. Now here's the Lila Bashan thing. And do you know that men all over the world are blaming Lila Bashan because she gained weight in her marriage? She was probably evil. This woman has had two children by this man, been with him 20 plus years, and put up with the fact that he has three outside children. Two and a possible. Three, yeah, two and a possible, three outside children. She stayed with him for 27 years. She's better than me because he probably would have been dead. He probably would have been dead if it was my way. I would have killed him. I want to keep my background and everything all set up. It is not set up. You see my clothes back there. You see my yoga mat. You know, different things back there because I got my little, I got a thin corner back there. You see my yoga mat, my little wallflower, my little positivity thing, things, my things about me loving clothes. All, all the, there's a mirror so I can look at it and say my positive affirmations. I got a whole zinc corner back there, y'all. So I got it. I got it hooked up the way I like. I'm moving soon, unfortunately. My landlord is turning this back to an Airbnb and it's not renewing our leases. So, Unfortunately, I have to find a new place to move. Hopefully, in the place I move, I'll get a bigger bedroom. My own bathroom. And, yeah, because I don't like sharing a bathroom with the people in the house because I have to clean up behind them, and I don't like that. And some of them smell like pickled onions. They smell like they don't bathe. And then when you was tiny. But... Back to Nicole, Community Vagina, Murphy. So she is having this, I guess, illicit affair with Anton Fuqua, who's married to Lily Shot. And um, she should be. And guys all over the world are blaming Lila Bashan. Lila Bashan supposedly, this is not confirmed, I don't know, has lupus. And lupus, as you know, can make you gain weight because of the medication that they put you on. So it's highly possible that that's the reason why she did what she did. Um, either way, it's not an excuse to cheat on your wife. Dudes are saying that 
he cheated up. How the fuck do you cheat up when you cheat on your wife? There's no cheating up when you cheat on your wife. Especially she's done nothing to you. Cheating up? How do you cheat up? Cheating is not an upgrade. Cheating is fucked up. That's the only way I can say it. It's not an upgrade. I'm not applauding him for cheating. Nicole Brown is beautiful. I've heard she had she had work done on her body. Um, my lip is going through changes. I got my water over here, y'all. I'm dehydrated. Uh, that's got issues. Um, she is beautiful to me. She they people are saying she has manly features. Guys are saying she can't keep a man, which is also true. She cannot. She is in her divorce decree from Andy Murphy. It says that she has to stay single in order to keep getting alimony from him. But she's had plenty of hours since then. So she could have been married to somebody if she wanted to and been having and living her best life with them and married to them and had her own money with them and everything. So there's no excuse to stay married to Eddie unless you want to keep Eddie's money and used to do it for his too. Sounds like an interesting concept. Sounds like an accurate concept. Don't know. I'm just saying. Sounds like. So, yeah, Nicole Brown Murphy is a hoe, basically. She issued a week about you. I thought they were divorced. You wouldn't have to think about my foot in your ass, I could tell you that. And I'm not a condoner of violence, but one thing, if you mess with my dude, I'm ready to draw blood, <clears throat> throw hands, all of the above. <sighs> These chicks are so ballsy out here. They're so ballsy. These dudes are ballsy. Oh, and I, oh, he is not without blame. I, I don't think he shit. He ain't shit. So I don't think he's without blame. He ain't shit. Okay? Please know that. He's a shitty ass dude. Um, But you expect better of a woman. You really expect better of a woman. And unfortunately, we didn't get that. So, yeah. Some complete and utter bullshit. It's not Layla Rashawn's fault that she can't wait. And if it is her fault that she can't wait, there's not enough reason for your husband to cheat on you. It's just not. There's no excuse for it. If you're unhappy in your marriage, if you're unhappy with that woman, leave her the fuck alone. Let her go on with somebody else who I'm sure is adoring her and thinking she's beautiful. Then move the fuck on. But you want to cheat on her with community vagina? Really? Nicole Murphy? I don't care how beautiful she is. The bitch can't keep him in. She ain't gonna be able to keep you either. She had five kids for Eddie Murphy. He left her ass or they left each other or whatever. And she ain't had good luck with men since. And I know it's hard out here, especially if you live in Atlanta. I don't know where she lives. But I think California. But she's so beautiful, boy, she can't keep no man. Did I tell you something, fellas? <clears throat> you can marry somebody for looks and their appearance. You can be with somebody for looks and their appearance. But on the inside, that's what's going to keep you situated in life. That's what's going to keep you situated in your life. Not how she looks. I'm just saying. Start. I know if that was me. I'm drunk Nicole Murphy. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. And I, like I said, I don't condone violence, but when it comes to my dude, you can catch these hands, baby. Catch these hands. Mmm. Well, that's just a short video about that. And I just want to test out my camera. Those are, like I said, those are my positivity things in the background. I have a million and one purses. I have no closet space, basically. So when I buy new clothes, they end up on the coat rack. Y'all, I got I to gotta get a bigger room next time I move. I, that's one thing I'm going to have the guy who gets places for me. I'm going to have him definitely look for places to have big rooms. I don't care if I live in a house or other people. I'm used to that now. It's no problem for me. Until I can, oh, the next thing I want to do is get a, a house. So I'm not going to, I don't want to rent and sign a, a long lease. 
more than a year and I don't want a big place where I, when I could be stashing my money for a, a house. So I, um, as long as I have my own room, I have a lock on my room and everything is secure, I'm fine with that. My nails need to be polished. Ooh, you know that. Yes. They're growing though, I can say that much. They were shorter than this, y'all. Believe it or not. But yeah, um, I like these little Miami summer colors I have on there. But um, yeah. Word of advice. If you're not happy with your wife, you could discuss things with her. If things are discussed and they don't change like you want, counseling. Counseling doesn't work. Then maybe divorce. But you gotta try everything before you just go stepping out on your wife because somebody you think is beautiful. For real. Anyway, you, you gotta do better better balance. And ladies, we need to start leaving these dudes when they have two or three outside babies on us. One, I don't even condone really one because I don't want him to have one on me, but two or three. She is saying if you ask me because I could kill it for us. Or one or one or two. Anyway, YouTubers, rate, comment, subscribe. Has this happened to you before? Do you know anybody in these circumstances? How do you feel about it? Do you agree with Nicole? Do you agree with Layla? Do you agree with Antoine? What, you, what is your take on it? Rate, comment, subscribe, share this video. Somebody else may benefit from it. But once I'm not talking about my single life, but I'm talking about somebody else's. But let me know what y'all think in the comments below. Have a good one.